you so fast. You see how fast you have to move the camera? <laughs> just got back from going to look at this house that Pook found online. Where'd you find it? Craigslist? Yeah. The Boy, I was gonna show you but as soon as we get home he takes off all his clothes and sits around in his boxers so I can't show you the bear. But <laughs> what? So we found this house on Craigslist and I wanted to go up to AT&T because I desperately need to upgrade my phone. Ice cream. <laughs> you don't like it. Um, so I wanted to go to AT&T and see what they could do in the store for me for an upgrade, which they don't do two-year contracts in store anymore. They only do next, and I asked her if they were going to be getting rid of two-year upgrades soon, and she said yes, which I knew was going to happen anyways, but it just stinks because I don't want my monthly bill to go up anymore, but pretty soon you're not going to have an option. But... Anywho, so Pook found this house on Craigslist and we just drove by. It was in the same town as where we were going anyway, so we just drove by and checked it out and it is perfection. And we're going back tomorrow night to meet the guy that's, I guess the owner, um, who's renting it out. And we're going to meet him, we're going to get to see the inside of the house because we just drove by and then wandered around the yard ourselves today. But tomorrow we'll meet the guy and see the house and it's really cool because it has a it's right on the water it has a boat dock so we wouldn't have to pay um an extra couple hundred dollars a month to have our boat somewhere we could have it right in the backyard it's got a huge yard for my little roof which is sleeping he didn't even get up when we got home he just kept snoring away over there yeah he don't care look at he's got his feet all brought oh good morning my angel did you want to say hello, hello? Hmm? You get so handsome. I guess he's up now. Now you want attention? I was just petting you, you were just sleeping. Anyhow. So tomorrow night we're going to go look at that house and then hopefully we can move in there. We'll have a nice yard for Rufus. We won't live on a third floor apartment anymore. And I'm really, really excited, but I'm not going to get too excited because who knows, but it'd be awesome. So yeah, we're going to do that tomorrow night. I'm probably going to go online and check out a new phone right now. Probably leave Team iPhone behind just because the iPhones aren't cheap enough. Excuse me, I just scratched my nose. But yeah. That's pretty much all we're doing today. What do you think, Pook? Big old yard, fire pit, boat dock right at the bottom. I can go take a couple of casts. Really nice neighborhood. It's not in a subdivision, which is very rare around here. We've been looking at houses to rent because our lease is going to be up here soon and we definitely want to get into a single family house if we can. So we've been looking in every every place that we find pretty much, almost all of them are in subdivisions. And the one that we found that we really loved that wasn't in a subdivision was rented out already when we called to look at it. So fingers crossed that this works out. This one has a boat dock. Does this one have a boat dock? Yep, right on the water. So this one, it is right on the water? Germ or worm, it will come. But does it have a boat dock? Boat dock right on the water, right in the backyard. I thought I had a boat dock just in land. Nope. It's right on the water? Right on the water. With a boat dock? Mm-hmm. In the backyard. Good to know. Yeah, my roofie will have his own yard. It's a big yard, too. Huge, huge yard. Big, big yard. But it's got a nice deck. I think the house itself is actually pretty small, but whatever. I'd rather have a big yard and a boat dock right on our property than have a small yard be in these subdivisions, because pretty much every other house we looked at is in a subdivision, which to me is annoying already. Some of them don't even have driveways anymore. Literally, they don't have driveways, right? Yeah. They're just like, the houses are like this close together, no driveways, everybody just parks in the street in front of their house, which I don't understand how they do it because 
the houses are so close together that you can't fit if you have more than one car I don't know where you park it's one of them that we drove by you couldn't even park on the other side of the road the one with no driveways I don't know it's just crazy they're all in subdivisions they're all like really nice new updated insides but there's no yard so it's like I don't know I'd rather have the yard and just clean up the inside myself than to pay the same amount of money no yard plus we'll have to like I said keep paying to um, dock the boat somewhere else so it's just crazy but fingers crossed it works out I'm probably gonna go have some ice cream now too what did I get poop mint chocolate chip I, I try and buy ice cream that he don't like because otherwise he eats all my ice cream but then I found out that even though he always talks crap about mint chocolate chip he'd be sneaking spoonfuls all the time even though he doesn't even like it you gotta try and make sure it's good that was good yeah, buy ice cream he doesn't like, so otherwise he eats all my food. Come to find out, he's eating the stuff he don't even like. Go and get some ice cream. Big prick. Uh, oh, look at this big guy. What a big lugger. Lisa, who owns a record label, and she's already looking at a field license and sample. It's been my one dream to be a singer ever since I was asked to get the attention. Honey, that's the wrong end to you. Then you want to be a singer. <laughs> I've been thinking about it. Thanks for you. Okay, I'm listening to your voice. Yeah, I also have to find my voice. I hear your voice is so strong. She goes, good morning, good morning, my Listen to it as well. Okay, so he's very excited about working with you. And I'm excited too because he comes from a huge family in this industry. Um, it's Carrie Gordon. What? <laughs> no, like Gordy? Yeah, Carrie like, Gordy. Very yes. Come on, you yeah, yeah. uh, What? Yes. Uh -oh. <laughs> I get excited. I love him. Carrie Gordy? Really? I mean, that is the son of Barry. Don't put a big rump in my face. Like, we never talk. And when I say never, I mean, like, I talk to all the girls. I never talk to them. So, I don't know. Everybody left me. And now I'm here to snuggle with you, too. How are you? Whoa! How is Penelope? She's such a lot. After a three-month time, it's like, okay. That's my ball. Right, I'm being here. Right now, she's having to be told to be holding her head up. You don't even play fetch with daddy anymore. It's only mom. You snuggle with the mama, you play with the ball with the mama. Because I sing to him. Talking crap, but he loves with mama. He's so fast. You see how fast you have to move the camera? It's like lightning. Look at all those Christmas presents we got over there. I wonder who the, who's the lucky people to get them presents. They're all Rufus. No. <laughs> Where we stand, guys. I'm doing some in your ass, Rufus. Move. <laughs> Don't swear. Oh, here we go. Look what you did. You got him all excited. Now I got a slobbery toy near the Christmas presents, and he's just rubbing his face. What are you doing, real? Well, I got invited by Polly and Bless you. Oh, from my blanket. That's my blanket. Here with the snacks. What are you So I was all excited, binge watching my Little Women LA show, then all of a sudden Pookie says, so what do you think? You think the game's on? <laughs> totally forgot the Patriots are playing tonight. 
why you do that? <laughs> this is what I live with. Hold on. Model. Oh, snap. Look at that. <laughs> Thursday night game this week. Patriots are 6-0. Playing the Dolphins.